All right, so it is uh, January now, so uh, I thought I would um, draw out and write out my uh, December recap and then like goals for January. Um, it's the sixth now, but I was actually I was like working all weekend and then you know before work I was recuperating from like New Year's Eve. So today was like kind of the first day of like actual productive work in January, um, and so I really wanted to get this um, spread finished and uh, done. Uh, so I kind of feel like I rushed through it a little bit, so I'm so sorry. Like I'm not really one for bullet journals and stuff, but I tend to follow a few people that, uh, like a few artists that also keep bullet journals. So I, I definitely watched my fair share of uh, bullet, bullet journaling <laughs> videos on the YouTubes. Um, and I've tried it in the past, um, but never really uh, uh, could uh, stick with it, um, to be honest. Uh, I think it, it's just kind of tedious um, for the most part, but I definitely do like to um, write down like monthly goals, especially since sometimes it's the end of the month and I feel like I haven't accomplished anything. So writing down everything that I accomplished in December, you know, whether that was art or or what I did with my friends, like it kind of just made me feel like, wow, a lot happened this month. Like this was a good month, you know. I think in general, uh, in December I did best financially. Like I definitely saved a lot of money um, and I think partly was because my car has been in the shop uh, since the beginning of December so I didn't really have my own car to drive around other than like you know I could drive my dad's car to work and that was about it so I didn't really um, drive around spending money and stuff because with my car I tend to like go to Starbucks or go out um, and get food you know and work outside you know so it's like I kind of left the house a lot more um, frequently, which kind of made me spend money um, that maybe I didn't necessarily need to spend. So this month was the best financially, I'd say. Um, and I actually got to hang out with my friends a lot too, even though it was like a big holiday month, obviously. So I spent a lot of time with family, but I also got to see my friends and that was cool. Um, and then art wise, honestly, not bad, not bad at all. Um, there's a few things that I have blurred out in this video because I, you know, I, you know, there's some things <laughs> I, I want to keep private, you know, obviously, like uh, my applications, like you guys don't need to know where I'm applying to, even though you probably haven't heard of any of these places because I hadn't heard of any of these places. I just kind of like, I usually just go on job sites like Indeed and Handshake and stuff. So most of the places I apply to, I hadn't heard, I haven't heard of before. And uh, I messed up with the calendar. I didn't really necessarily mess up. I just uh, didn't really like how I uh, kind of laid out my January month. So I redid it. Um, and I still don't really know <laughs> if I like that. But I, I mean, honestly, just wanted to get this spread done. So I just kind of, you know, I was like, this is fine. <laughs> Also, these marker pen things I got for Christmas, I had asked my parents for, like, um, a brush, I, I, honestly, I just asked them for, like, a brush pen, um, and they got me these, all of these, like, so many, so many colors, just all the colors, and then there's, like, it's, like, a dual brush, so, like, one side is a brush pen, and the other side is, like, fine tip, um, it's not that fine, I, I definitely need to get some, like, fine liners, because I'm running out, like, I've run out of all my fine liners, like, they're all like out of ink or just not looking as good as they could, you know, so I really need to get new fine liners. Also, I uh, skipped the sketching part of of this drawing because I, I'm i just not that great with sketching um, in front of the camera, like honestly, <laughs> like just because it's not like the most comfortable angle to draw um, with the camera above the, you know, because I can't like can't hold the sketchbook how I normally like to hold it to draw and like it's just not the most comfortable like my head you, you know what I mean so I just sketched it um, and then I filmed like the lining and the coloring and stuff uh, one thing I've noticed is the pens that I got um, are just not the best with coloring in like honestly like 
for just drawing in my sketchbook I think they're kind of good I just probably won't use them for like proper um, finished pieces which is one thing that I do want to um, work on in January which I actually don't think I put on here but I should do that should include another bullet point which says um, like work on more finished pieces but I guess that's more a a goal for 2020 versus January 2020 you know what I mean I just kind of in general this year I want to focus more on finished pieces because I feel like this last year I sketched a lot of my sketchbook which was great and like thinking back to the beginning of the year like I improved a lot in my drawing um, but I think I need to work on actually finishing pieces and not just sketching you know uh, but but I guess to like read off some goals for January um, in December I had only gotten two frames done of my animation that I've been working on I know that sounds so sad but like honestly like it's been really hard for me to be like productive but yeah so my goal for January is to at least do 20 frames which seems so small to be like wow you only got 20 frames done this month but I just really have uh, had a problem with like over um like setting high goals for myself that I can't actually accomplish with like all the other things I need to do so like with having a job and everything so I'm just like you know what let's keep it easy on myself 20 frames anyways I'm rambling too much uh so I hope I hope you enjoyed and um I look forward to the next one I guess I don't really know what I'm gonna do next but uh, we'll figure, we'll figure something out. So yeah, until next time. Bye.